If you're looking for scriptures to pray over your kids, then this video is just for you. Hi friends, welcome back to the channel. My name is Shayla and I'm the creator of Junk Drawer Mom. My mission is to help you as a Christian mother live a life that's full of grace and confidence in Jesus. Um, so today I wanna talk about how to pray scriptures over your children. So if you're uh, a new believer or you really wanna try to incorporate more prayer, I mean, I'm sorry, more um, scripture into your prayer life, um, then this is a good way to do it, especially when you're praying for your kids. I just feel like praying for your children is something that can be glossed over because it just kind of slips our mind. We're so worried about like, are they getting enough to eat? And are they developing properly? And are do they have the clothes they need in school? And all these things, but like taking care and nurturing the spiritual side of them is just as important, if not more important. So the Bible is not only a story of how God has redeemed us. You can actually use scriptures um, to pray and ask God to implement those things in your life. Uh, you, confess th you can confess those things in your life as well. So let me give you an example. So um, I'm just looking at my notes here, but if you wanted to uh, pray a scripture, it's pretty simple. You would just read the verse and then you personalize it. So um, here's one, Isaiah 54, 13. Um, it says, all your children shall be taught by the Lord and great shall be the peace of your children. That's a great verse. Um, and so the prayer would be, Lord, I pray that my children would be taught by you and that your peace will guard their hearts and minds. And then you could continue along in that vein. Um, maybe you want their heart and mind to be guarded from things that they see on social media or influences at school, etc. And you would just, you know, pray along those lines. Uh, here's another one, uh, Psalm 139, 13 and 14. It says, for you've created my inmost being. You knit me together in my mother's womb. I praise you because I am fearfully and wonderfully made. So the prayer for this, it would be, thank you, Lord, for fearfully and wonderfully creating my children. Help them to see their unique value in, in your eyes. So maybe you have a kid who is dealing with um, uh, depression or not feeling like they're popular or insecurity or whatever it is, you could pray and ask God to reveal to them, how is it that you see my children? Uh, reveal that to them. So you're literally just taking the, the words from the verses and you're personalizing them. You can even add your children's names um, in there as well. So this is not only a great way to rehearse uh, Bible verses, but also to memorize them. Like scripture doesn't expire just because you read it one time or you say it or you, or you pray it one time. You can do this over and over and over again. Like God hears and answers our prayers. A lot of us are here based on the prayers of our parents or our grandparents or even our great grandparents. Like God is faithful to his word and that's just his nature. He is just good. Okay, so here's some more. I've got Proverbs 22 verse six. It says, start children off on the way they should go. Even when they are old, they will not turn from it. So the prayer would be, Lord, grant me the wisdom to raise your um, my children in your love and truth. May they always walk in your ways. Um, here's another one, Third John 1, 4. It says, I have no greater joy than to hear that my children are walking in the truth. So the prayer would be, oh Lord, may my children always walk in your truth, bringing joy to your heart and to mine. And here's another one, 1 Timothy 4.12. It says, don't let anyone look down on you because you're young, but set an example for the believers in speech, in conduct, in love, in faith, and in purity. So the prayer for that would be something like, Lord, empower my children to be examples of faith, love, and purity to everyone around them. So if you're looking for more ways to pray scripture, I've created a completely free prayer prompts guide for you. Um, these, will, uh, these are all scripture based and it'll help you to have a more dynamic prayer life. Um, I will put the description, I'll put the link in my description box um, and subscribe to my channel for more tips.